Today we're going to be talking about the latest slot updates from the US Embassy. There's been some major updates to the platform and one of the biggest updates is this. Right over here, as you can see on the screen, it says access limitation. Your attempt to view the calendar section was blocked due to a violation of prohibited conduct clause in terms conditions of the appointment system. Now they have actually added a new section or prohibited conduct, which has now come to include the fact that you should not be using these extensions to essentially basically check for visa slots or check essentially what's going on you know when the slots are available in order to check this availability they want you to check it normally manually yourself and again i'll tell you how to do that there's still a workaround but the point is don't use extensions or you will come to be banned and the way it works is that the ban itself remains for 24 hours and then after that you have to try again and then maybe it gets lifted but if you've been using extensions i know that these people some people have been facing this issue for, for two or three days now so please remove all extensions in many cases we even start using a new laptop you know if uh, any of these uh you know laptops had any extension do not use them in order to make sure that you do not compromise on an opening because imagine what happens is Let's say then an opening happens, slots are available and you, my friend, were using an extension. Well, your account is banned for 24 hours and then the opening is probably going to finish off by then. You can take a look at uh, reviews from people who are actually, you know, you, who were happy to use extensions previously, but now they've actually started facing this issue as well. Moving forward, I want to give you the updates for the visa type students, business and tourism, and finally work visas. We're going to be discussing all of those in this video as well. So one thing we noticed recently is that for student visas, we've seen different accounts showing different kinds of slots. For instance, take a look at this. This student is able to see all kinds of slots, whereas this student who was rejected recently, for instance, is not able to see any slots whatsoever. So rejected candidates also, you will see that, you know, based on the date of your rejection, based on when you were rejected, you will see slots according to that date itself. So if you were rejected recently, you may not see any slots. Whereas if you were rejected a little bit ago, you know, a while ago, essentially, you may actually start seeing them. Now, this depends on account to account, person to person, and hence, the monitoring has to be even more strong. Remember that major openings can finish off in less than 15 minutes, so monitor 24-7. The way to do that and the general way to do that is not for extensions, but to have a group with your friends or people who are on the same journey and will help you find those groups if you like. But for now, essentially, you want to do that by yourself, create groups with your friends and then keep on monitoring. And keep in mind that minor openings are still ongoing. Latest slot book was for 12th of July, which is very recent, right? Uh, it's, it's just upcoming. So mine openings are happening, so don't miss out on them. And if you're missing out, you need help, you can reach out to me on WhatsApp. The number is going to be in the description down below. And let's move forward now. We're going to be talking about the business and tourism visas next. So as you can see, the normal appointments available right now are for November 2025. It's so far, so far off. However, what I would recommend is that you still book a placeholder at least or keep that as a backup essentially because in the last one year, there has been no major opening for B1, B2 candidates, only minor openings. We do expect one major opening by August because after the student visa season, usually they open up some business and tourism bun for parents. But let's hope that it happens. And if it does, we'll be keeping you updated on Instagram. So make sure that you're following me over there. But remember, you keep monitoring 24-7 because openings can last just 15 minutes, like I said. Minor openings, they are still happening for B1, B2. Latest slot book was the 10th of September. Now let's move on to the work visas. That's the H1B, H4, L1, L2, anyone essentially who's going on a work visa or the dependents. The early slots right now available are of November 2024. These are the normal slots. However, keep in mind that minor openings are ongoing on the basis of which we were actually able to get a slot for 28th of August, for instance, for one of our clients recently. So keep on monitoring. Don't miss out. And if you need help, you know where to reach me. You can reach me on WhatsApp. Again, we'll keep you posted on any other updates regarding the website, whatever's going on on either our YouTube or our Instagram. So make sure that you subscribe and I wish to see you in the next one. All the best until next time.